I told you all that I was the greatest of all time. Wanna be Sunday listen? I told you today I'm still the greatest of all time. Never again defeat me. Never again say that I'm going to be defeated. Never again make me the underdog until I'm about 50 years old. That's right. Then you might get me. Welcome to Muhammad Ali's 50th birthday celebration from the Wilkins Theater in Los Angeles. Ladies and gentlemen, Dustin Hoffman. Good evening. Tonight, we're here to honor one of the most remarkable athletes of all time, celebrating his 50th birthday, ladies and gentlemen, the greatest, Muhammad Ali. He told me backstage he was tricked into this. <laughs> <laughs> now, on occasions such as this, you might think that we're going to go on and on about the incredible record this man has achieved in the ring. You might think that we're going to talk about what a great humanitarian he is. You might think that we're going to rave about his accomplishments as a leader of social causes, a man of courage and conviction. And you might think that we're going to talk about a man who has raised untold sums of money throughout the world to help the poor and the needy. Some of you might think we're going to reflect back on the more humorous aspects of his career and have some fun at his expense. <laughs> well, if that's what you think. <laughs> if that's what you think, you're very perceptive. <laughs> And to start this evening's program, we have one of the few people in the world who even Ali acknowledges as prettier than he is, Miss Whitney Houston. <laughs> was born, Muhammad Ali was already the heavyweight champion. So, <laughs> so I never knew a world without Muhammad Ali. Then when I was just a young teenager, I went to the theater and saw a movie called The Greatest. It was about the life of Muhammad Ali. I thought you were the most marvelous man I'd ever seen. And in that movie, there was a song. The song was as inspirational as you were. I loved the song as I loved Muhammad Ali. And a few years later, I had the opportunity to record it. I've sung it many times in many places to many people. But this is the first time I've had the opportunity to sing it to the greatest, one of the greatest men of all. I love you. Children are our future. We got to teach them well and let them lead the way. Show them all that beauty they possess inside. Her. 
give them a sense, give them a sense of pride. It'll make it easy. Let, let the children lie. Searching for people need someone to look up to. I've never found anyone who fulfilled my needs. It's a lonely, lonely place to be, but I learned to depend. Children of our future, teach them well, let them lead, show them all that beauty they possess inside, give them a sense of pride, it'll make it easy, easy. special place that you've been dreaming of, my love, should lead you to
Bravo for the Humble, Dan Aykroyd, Cameron, and Billy Crystal.